Let me share my personal experience with you. Some time ago, where I was working, I had set a time I wanted to go on fasting for one week. For one week. One full week. And I set it a while that on so 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 time I mark it in the calendar, I'll be on fasting for one week. But me, I didn't know that as the devil will have it, not God. Because the company decided to send me on a course for that one week. And it was one of the biggest hotels in this city, Lagos. And it's the course started the day I was supposed to start my fast. So we all arrive at the hotel. They check us in. After we they call everybody to come to the classroom. And we all go to the classroom. Beautiful environment. Before we can even start the class at all, they gave it's your choice. It's different type of tea, coffee, beverage, lipstick, different types of tea, same milk, your choice. Just go and take it the way you want. Praise God. Me, I was supposed to fast that very day. Anyone you want to use, you can use snacks, you can use bread. And the bread is not the agige bread. The kind of bread that when you see yourself, you know, ah, this one should not pass me. So every other person, they were enjoying themselves eating those things when we finish all of us are in the same class and then they put some other little things in front of people like sweets chocolate sweets all those bits. so as they are taking lecture they are licking and i'm supposed to fast on that day god what is happening praise god i even endure that one after about two hours they said people should go for a short break they went for a short break they were eating all the shit i was still fasting after two hours after about a 10 minutes we will return back or 20 minutes we return back or return back we continue that it was a marathon now i was becoming tired and hungry now these people they were very very sharp they were doing asking questions in class they were doing answering questions me i was already getting tired because it was a serious lecture after that we now went for a long break we are done long break to return back in one hour time now we now enter the main place where they put the main food swallow Spoon in spoon inspired food. Understand? They put all those in there. Come and see chicken where you're looking at me like this. Hallelujah. <laughs> and my colleagues, those that knew that I wasn't eating, they had earlier come to say, Are you not taking something? I said, I am okay. So they believe that this time around, this man, you must go you are hungry. Ah, I look at this thing like this. Come and see my colleague. The one I want to take, Pandanyan was taken, Fufu was taken, Eba was taken, rice was taken, different type of rice, country food and all, and intercontinental food. Everything was just there. They were just eating. I was asking myself, God, can't I shift this fasting to next week? <laughs> Praise God. I said, ah, can't I shift this thing? Because this is going to last for one week. Old. But I can say fast that next week. It's still one week too. Ah, God. God didn't answer me. And I said, I endured that day one. We finished the evening. We went back to go and rest. I broke my fast in the evening. I was just thinking, tomorrow I'll continue this circle like this again. God, God, can't I shift this thing the next week? I didn't get any answer from God. So since I didn't get any answer from God, I now ask for grace. Give me grace that when they are chewing all these things, I will not be moved. I pray to God and thank God I didn't fail God throughout that week. I missed those food. I didn't even remember to tell that there was a time that the thought came to my mind that your company have already paid for this, you know. You are wasting the company's money because they paid for you too to also enjoy this thing. But I denied it. And I finished it that week, that Friday. And I got back, I was celebrating victory. I said, God, you helped me. So I know what it is to be tempted by the devil not to fast.